Okay, how to remove the lens of a Pi version 1 camera. So, first thing you'll notice, uh, I'm doing this under a, a stereo microscope. Uh, it seems to help me. So, I'd advise that. I have diagonal cutters and a, an X-Acto blade. First thing you'll notice is the camera's really floppy and it'll pop out of this connector really easily. So the first thing I do is I'm going to remove the double stick tape below. Oops, actually I just popped it out so why don't I show it to you. So on the bottom there's the double stick tape and let me, you just want to pull off the, there. Aha, uh -huh. okay. So now I'm going to put it back in the connector. Good. And I'm going to hold it down so it's seated. And then I'm just going to push the camera where it wants to sit naturally so there's no strain on the connector. Okay, so now it's holding in place pretty rigidly. Now, you can take off this tape if you want. That protects the lens. Now, notice the uh, lens is screwed into this plastic case there's a little drop of epoxy so you can't change the focus of the lens but we're going to take it off anyway so you got the lens you got the upper portion of the case and then the bottom portion which is connected to the chip the important thing is you want to remove the top section but not the bottom because if you remove the bottom section it'll take off the glass and you'll have all those gold bonded wires exposed so the key is do it in little tiny bits. Uh, don't take a big chunk it or you'll break the whole thing. So just nibble with this. So what I'm first going to do, I'm going to put it um, right on top of the uh, on the top. I'm going to actually hold it down with my finger because I don't want to stress anything. And I'm just nibbling away at the at the threaded ring that holds the lens. And you can start seeing it separating. Oop! And it just separated. I'm going to pull a little more and I can just get the lens out. Pop. There's the lens. Now, we're not going to use the lens, but save it for a rainy day. Now, the important thing is make sure your tool never um, uh, goes down and hits the glass because you'll scrape it. So be very careful. Uh, rest your hand on something so you get a steady grip. And now I'm going to just nibble away and I'm actually going to nibble the side here and, and be careful take little pieces and once you get enough of it grabbed you'll see and I'm gonna wiggle a little it just wants to boop separate isn't that beautiful so just go slowly and you'll get to this point and now you have that's the glass and you want to make sure you have the glass and you can see there's a little remnant of that but it's really two pieces. This is the bottom piece. This is what you want. Go slow and steady and you'll get this pristine glass.